Hello everybody and welcome to Excel Made Easy. Uh, this is your Excel Guru today with a new formula called D counter. Uh, as we all know, what does D counter do? What does counter do? Counter counts the cells, the number of cells in a given range which are not empty. They may be containing uh, numerics, alphabets, or special characters. So then, what does D counter do? It, uh, it does the same thing but on an advanced level it allows you to even add conditions to it so for example I'll be counting uh, the cells which are not empty however the condition would be the name of the tier uh, tree should be peer and the age of the trees should be greater than nine years so we're going to do that in two ways the first is by entering the formula syntax which is my favorite the second one is going to the formula tab and using the FX feature so let's start the formula by typing is equal to D C O U N C O U N T A parenthesis open database. Now when we are doing any feature which starts with a D, any formula like D count, D sum, D average, D product. Now here we have to ensure that there is a pre formatted database that we give to Excel. Now this database should not have any rows which are completely empty, any columns which are completely empty. Uh, a cell empty here and there would be okay but not complete rows or columns and it should be pre-formatted now I choose the database then I give the field the field can be any 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 header on the column name so let's say we're choosing age as the field we do a comma hey I'll teach you a cool trick uh, uh, if I choose this and see this was the field cell okay e9 if I press f9 uh, the content of the cell would start appearing over here that is age isn't it cool and then I click on the criteria now that is another thing that that's also a prerequisite in doing these kind of formulas which is you should have a criterion field ready already a pre-formatted criterion field with the name of the headers same as these and the conditions built in so my condition is the tree's name should be fear and the age should be greater than nine so I close the bracket and this is how the cells which are not empty the count of the cells which are not empty uh, which also contain the name of the tree as peer and the age of the tree is should be greater than nine then that is one now if I change it to say apple a p p l e and the C it changes to two cool and the same way I'm going to do it using the FX feature we go to the formula tab insert function we type in D C O U N T A oh we did not type D and click on go all the formulas relevant to D counter uh, show up over here I have already done D sum I've done D count I've done D average D get D max and D min would be done next by me and I'm plan to take my video library to around 1500 videos more than that so we'll do it this way database is again this is my database a pre-formatted database which does not have any single rows or any single column empty and then I go to field I can choose this field say height or age and then the criteria this is again has to be pre-formatted and I choose the criteria the name of the tree is apple the age is greater than nine and I click on OK and this is the answer isn't it cool wonderful feature of Excel Excel is lovely okay and the, the Excel file used in this training video is available for free download on my website excelmadeeasy.weebly.com all you need to do is go to the training files page and download the file for free for reference to follow along later now or just for practice and also on my page are my links to my social networks uh, IDs Twitter Facebook and YouTube now you can follow me on Twitter by clicking over here if you believe that what I'm doing is right if you believe that knowledge should be shared then click on follow me on Twitter and this is what you'll see and then follow not only follow then retweet share it with your friends go to Facebook like us on Facebook and it will take you to my page do like us and then share the content 
not only like it share it go to YouTube subscribe to us by clicking on subscribe sign in or sign up just enter your email ID and your basic data and then you can subscribe to me whenever I upload a new video you will be made aware by YouTube most important subscribe and also share the data share the videos with your friends on these networks it's so very simple so this is your Excel guru signing off for the day have a wonderful day ahead happy Excel learning